Mouse. Mouse. Alright, I'm gonna play for a little bit, and then I'm gonna get hungry, and then I'm gonna warm up the rest of my pizza. And then I'm gonna take a break and play some more, because that's fun. Now, I believe we are... Click. Not at the moment attacked, I broke the siege. Chaos is left wandering around in a daze, though. And we've got some crisis um, to manage. Chaos is also wounded. Um, oh man, she's, is she gonna bleed out as she... Oh, that would be not good if she bleeds out as she is wandering around in a daze. If she doesn't come too soon, I might need to arrest her and then heal her and then convince her again to join the colony. That's a little scary. I gotta rebuild this wall, but let's keep it open for now. Um, 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 um. Yes. Let's keep it open for a while over here. Just so Chaos has a way of coming back. Yes. And when the crisis is over, we will come back to making wooden floors everywhere so that the movement speed around the colony is quicker. But for now, you do the essentials, repair, repair everything. I've, I've got food, I, I grabbed it from the siege camp, so I suppose cooking is... Man, how long will you do that, Chaos? How's your health? Hope you're gonna be enough. OH MY GOSH! It's, WHAT THE FUCK?! SHE JUST BLED TO DEATH LIKE THAT?! Oh. My. Fuck, no, no, uh, I was, wait, uh, uh, so, wait a second, no, uh, so I was, Unclear on on how the game mechanics work exactly because I was looking at her HP. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, I was looking here at her HP. It's like 30 out of a hundred It doesn't say anything here really. I mean it Doesn't indicate anything that would tell me when she bleeds out completely. Where's the indicator? What was the the point at which she died. Does the blood loss reach a hundred and then she dies? Let's see if we can still rescue her by arresting her. Blood loss 90%. 93. Almost picked her up, and she died. There's nothing I can do. We just lost our surgeon, our best doctor, our best shot. Nothing I could have done. I I had to do something prior to this. I had to do something previously. Oh my god. We lost our cook too, didn't we? No, Nesroth is a chef. Fuck, we did lose our doctor, though. I mean, Lomas is nowhere near as good as Chaos was. And I had that bionic eye in her as well. Fucking hell. I wish I could extract the bionic eye, honestly. God, that sucks! 
You can harvest the eye? I, there is no button for it anywhere that I can tell. That might be a mod then, yeah. It might be a mod that I haven't installed. I wanted my first playthrough on the stream to be pure without mods so I can show you the base game. Oh my god. Yeah, that is fucked up. That is fucked up plenty. Guys, nothing happened. Everyone back to normal. Don't worry about it. The devil strand is growing. Ten days and we'll have it. Freaking hell. Yeah, drink some beer. A little sad. I could go to the health tab of a dead person and add bills to remove parts. Oh, I never checked there. Oh, you might be right. Damn it. Hang on. Um, so, Manny. Health. Uh, not exactly. Maybe because she doesn't have any parts. I don't know. But that's a lot of silver, actually. That I wouldn't mind picking up, picking up right now. Thunder. Grab the silver, it's the money. Also, do you have a helmet? You do have a helmet. Chaos was literally my favorite, my best. And she broke, she just broke mentally. Started wandering around there. And I didn't think to arrest her in time, I didn't realize she was bleeding until it was too late. There's so much work to do, so much hauling, so much farming. And there are only four people. Titan, why don't you prioritize building that console so we can trade again? Stone cutting. No, 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 no. We need to prioritize on working on this. Cleaning dirt. Prioritize working on this. Prioritize working on this. Prioritize some more. Okay. He's doing just one job for it. Okay. I suppose I should just give someone priority in constructing instead. If I want this to be done right. Yeah, Calreal, you need to be doing the art still. Say for thunder growing and constructing will be the same priority. Well, cause I need a slave trader, I need to buy myself another colonist, but it's gonna be too expensive. I need some. I need an exotic goods trader so I can sell the sculptures that Calreal will make, and then I need uh, a slave trader buy myself a proper colonist. I'm gonna go put the pizza in the oven, because I'm a little hungry right now. You guys sleep it off. You guys sleep it off. It's a sad day for everyone. The music is chill indeed, Shotgun. No kidding. I mean, considering what just happened, it's too chill for 
my own place. Oh yeah, and I was supposed to build that and it's, it's so much to do, so much to build. I guess I'll just leave them to it. What? Oh yeah, I don't have wood for that. I need to chop down the wood as well. Maybe I queued up too much and it's unnecessary. Maybe it's just terribly unnecessary. But I want this movement speed here. I do. I'm gonna speed up the the work around the colony for the rest of my playthrough. Calreal is preparing a large sculpture out of marble. What's it gonna be? Can't say yet. Oh. He didn't tell anyone yet what it's gonna be. Titan is keeping it clear. You know what, Nesseroth? Actually... It seems like we don't have much in the way of uh, fine and lavish meals, considering that we're kind of lacking meat, and hunting those jungle animals is very inefficient compared to other animals I've seen in other biomes, like like buffalo, that would provide a lot of meat. So, how do, why don't I just skip on the hunting and embrace the fact that I will be eating simple meals for a while, and just get a large stockpile of them from what we've farmed up. Though, actually, I have to admit, we don't have that much farmed up anymore. I guess now we just have to hold the rice and, and the corn, but we'll have it, we'll have enough to feed four people. You would think that at this point I'd have more colonists, but... Combat supplier, not exactly what we need. We need to sell the art at a exotic goods, and then we need to buy a slave at the slave trader. Like, not ready yet. Womos, the research may not be that important right now, honestly. Why don't you drop the research? Do something useful instead. Help Thunder with the building. Oh, Barrington! Hey there, welcome! You just missed an entire playthrough of There Came an Echo. A game completely driven by voice that I was testing out on my stream and I played through the entire thing in three hours. On hard difficulty, no less. Titan, what are you grabbing? Oh fuck, what? Did you really need to consume it from here? I guess you might as well pick up the artillery shells now that you're here, huh? Uh, they're building up the, where those when those defenses are ready I'm gonna open those cas caskets and see what comes out of them and then either kill it or recruit it a uh, cluster of pods with cobra flesh I love it yeah I'm gonna have some more than simple meals Nesseroth is holding steel for the turret why don't you instead he's not a hauler but he can build okay I see so the only steel I have available left is out there shit that's not good that's not good. We need the, we need to set up the mining order then. Lima. Mouse. Click. And Womos. Click. Click. Home. Why don't you grab that Cobra Flash before it goes bad? Put it in the refrigerator room. drops Cobra Flesh out of the sky anyway? Like, um. Where are you going, Thunder? Grabbing steel from another siege camp here. You know what? Might want to prioritize holding all this steel rather than grabbing a little bit of it. Yeah. I don't want to forbid these things for now. Also, this guy. No, no. This guy is a cloth too. Nah, no, that's not interesting. Triv. A dead tortoise. That's desiccated. That's not, that doesn't sound very fun either. 
I need to manage properly what they grab and what they don't grab from these siege camps because not everything's worth the trip. Like, this knife could actually sell pretty nicely. This is already like pretty ruined. Screw the shivs. Shivs are not worth it. Okay, I'll take the sniper rifle. Armor. Oh, a better armor vest. Thunder, why don't you. Equip that armor vest instead of yours. And then still prioritize holding the steel. Taking a long time. Taking a long time for it, but it's gonna sell for a lot though. She's a good sculptor. And the beautiful cobra flesh meals. Actually, actually, wait a second. I need to set so that the simple meals are vegetarian. So that he needs to make better meals out of Cobra Flash, because otherwise it's kind of a waste, isn't it? I can make the simple meals out of potatoes, no problem. Nesworth, what are you doing? Cooking lavish meal. Oh, what? Some of it isn't, is not hold yet. Titan. Stone cutting. My ass, you are. Grab the Cobra Flash. What are you doing? Oh, making beer. Yeah, go right ahead, I suppose. Why are these unpowered? Okay, good now. This one still isn't. How does my power look here? Should be good enough. Unless the granite door doesn't... doesn't... conduct... Our, no, if, if these are powered, this should be too. What the hell? What's wrong with this turret? It seems connected. Look at this. Oh no, every other turret is connected to uh, the circuit from beyond this door. So obviously this piece of the circuit just doesn't work yet. As if this door was somehow not condu conducting electricity like every other door. Nestroth is binging on alcohol. God damn it. Why am I even producing this beer? What is the positive effect of that? And then, oh yeah, so they get really happy for a while. But you don't need the alcohol until they start feeling really bad, I suppose, because there's no upside to having really happy people as opposed to just a little happy people. And there's uh, no upside that I have noticed, right? So it doesn't matter if someone is really, really happy. Alright, considering that the turrets are ready, let's open the Crypto Sleep Casket and see who, who comes out. Oh god. Lots of dead people. And then let's rescue... These two. And then we're gonna have some friends. Are they already part of the... They're guests! Dr. Scared gets medicine. Wait, so I... How could I recruit them? I guess arrest, then. But they don't say where they're from. I wonder if they will join me or... Oh my god, 20 social. That would be a godlike warden. Wow, but... Incapable of violent things. And what about Stewart here? Stewart's a researcher. I guess it would be for general labor. Can't do everything. Heat lovers nice in this climate. I'd like them both to join.
I'm not sure if they just leave me once they're... I guess we can... we can treat them nicely for now. She just peed herself, didn't she? No, she's vomiting. Shit, what's happening to her? Whole body crypto sleep sickness. Uh, bad back, that's, that's not good. Oh man, yeah, she's not gonna be... Extreme pain as well, oh my god. What is happening to these people? They better... They better get better fast. The gamer. I just played through There Came an Echo and that was really fun. Now I'm coming back to... Uh, to RimWorld and I lost Chaos, my best medic, my best surgeon and my best shooter as well. So... It's a little rough. It's a little bit rough. And then I opened the crypto sleep caskets. Those those people came out, two of them alive, and I'm not sure if they will join me if I treat them as guests or do I need to make them prisoners first. We'll see, we'll see. Lord Carino? Oh yes, oh yes, a wonderful day. There came an echo is a tactical RPG that is uh voice driven. It's actually built to be voice driven from the get go and you you basically are supposed to play the entire game by voice. You can you can not even touch the mouse at any point, and it was a pretty unique experience, and I really appreciate that. I wish more games were like that actually, because it was pretty cool mechanically speaking. The game was a little too short for my own liking, so I'm not sure if it was worth the full price. But I gotta admit, it was a pretty cool, unique mechanical experience. Nesseroth, you goddamn drunk again! To stop that. He's broken and binging. Why is he getting broken all the time? What's, what's wrong with his mood? Oh, he's got a, sl a major sleeping sickness. Maybe that's gonna make him a little unhappy, but... No, he's usually generally really... Ha Wait, his threshold. Is this his breaking threshold? I thought this was his breaking threshold. Yeah, it says breaking threshold 20%. And his mood is really, really high. Why did he... Oh, bro why is he broken? If, if he's this happy, even without the alcohol, he would be really, really happy. I really just don't know. But maybe I should just not have alcohol, because this guy's just a goddamn drunk. Is what he is. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to grab my pizza. I'm starving over here. Th this has been like four hours of live streaming without a proper food break other than just snacking on chocolate. So guys, I'm gonna be back when I take care of the pizza and we're gonna have more adventures in RimWorld. I don't know what else I'm gonna do today, but I'm gonna do plenty. This is gonna be a pretty long stream, it seems. I'm having a lot of fun here in this casual setting. If you enjoy it too, stay around. We're gonna have some more fun.